Hello everyone. Welcome to our channel Ask Prep. In today's series on 11th grade physics, we will be studying chapter 13, kinetic theory in detail. Let's start the video. Starting with ideal gas. An ideal gas or perfect gas is a gas that strictly obeys gas laws such as Boyle's law, Charles's law, Gay-Lussac's law, etc. An ideal gas has the following characteristics. 1. The molecules of an ideal gas are point masses with no geometrical dimensions. 2. There is no force of attraction or repulsion between the molecules of the gas. Next up, we will understand Boyle's law, Charles' law and Gay-Lussac's law or pressure law. Three gas laws. Boyle's law, Charles' law and Gay-Lussac's law. And I think it will be helpful if we see it all in a chart so we can see how each one is a little bit different and they are also a little the same. So let's get started with Boyle's law. A constant is mass and it states that pressure and volume are inversely proportional. And you can take a look at this graph and you can see that as pressure increases, volume goes down and its pressure decreases volume goes up. Now let's talk about density. Pressure and density are directly proportional. So as pressure goes up, so does density. And the formula is P1 over V1 equals P2 over V2. P is pressure, V is volume. Or you can see it as pressure times volume equals K, which is a proportionality constant. Now let's move over to Charles law with this. The constant is pressure and it states that temperature and volume are directly proportional. And you can see in the graph that is temperature goes up, so does the volume. Density, it is inversely proportional to temperature. So as temperature goes up, so does the volume. But the density goes down. When temperature drops, volume drops and density goes up. The formula V1 over T1 equals V2 over T2. V is for volume, T is for temperature or volume divided by temperature equals K proportionality constant. And finally we have Gay-Lussac's law which is also called a pressure and temperature law. And in this case mass is fixed and volume is a constant and it states that pressure and temperature are directly proportional. So as temperature goes up, so does pressure. And the formula for that is P1 over T1 equals P2 over T2 where P is pressure and T is temperature. So there we go, three gas law, a brief introduction. Next is equation of state of an ideal gas. The relationship between pressure P, volume V and absolute temperature T of a gas is called its equation of state. The equation of state of an ideal gas is PV equals nRT, where n is the number of moles of the enclosed gas and R is the molar gas constant, which is the same for all gases. Kinetic interpretation of temperature. The total average kinetic energy of all the molecules of a gas is proportional to its absolute temperature, T. Thus, the temperature of a gas is a measure of the average kinetic energy, U, of the molecules of the gas. U equals 3 halves RT. According to this interpretation of temperature, the average kinetic energy U is 0 at T equals 0. That is, the motion of molecules ceases altogether at absolute 0. Thank you for watching. We will be dropping notes in the description of this video. If you found this video helpful, kindly like, subscribe, and share. See you in the next video. All the best for your exams.